Most people know Stephanie Rose as a successful mother, wife, and musician, but many don't know she is also a brain aneurysm survivor. She says she found out 10 years ago after she had the worst headache of her life. So I had a, a really bad headache. It was almost like a knife stabbing me in the back of the head. Stayed in the MRI machine for a really long time. Kind of things going through my mind, I'm like, Oh, maybe something's not quite right. I was told that I had um, an aneurysm, and but I was told that I had an aneurysm that was not in my brain. It was in my cavernous sinus, so it was just below my brain. And you know, back 10 years ago, imaging was not what it is today. With that diagnosis, Stephanie was told to continue having scans but to go on with a normal life. You know, I just, I decided, you know, live life. That's what you've got to do. Um, and probably about a couple months after that is uh, when Coltown Dixie formed. Right. We started an all-female bluegrass band and that's been a great adventure. <laughs> But after a few years, things started to change. I started having um, some memory issues. I guess it's been about four years ago. And I was, um, I was getting dizzy um, and just, I knew something wasn't quite right. The doctor came in and, you know, I was just waiting to hear, well, you know, maybe the aneurysm had gotten larger. I was not expecting to hear, well, your aneurysm's actually in your brain, not really in the cavernous sinus. So that was kind of, that was a little bit of a game changer. Things continued to deteriorate, and two years ago, Stephanie had surgery to place a stent in her brain. After um, having the stent, it, it was hard for me to even process sentences at times um, because I was having some memory issues. And that has, that's gotten a lot better. With, it, with anything, there's good days and bad days. Um, you know, I, I still have migraines. Um, I'll stop mid-sentence sometimes and like forget what I'm saying. Um, but who doesn't have things that they're dealing with? You know, everybody has a burden to bear. But her long-term outlook is good. The brain aneurysm should be gone by now. Um, you know, the stent's there. Uh, it allows the aneurysm to basically shrivel up and die. So the, the brain aneurysm should be gone. And now she is speaking out with the hopes that others will notice the signs of a brain aneurysm before it's too late. You know, so many people probably are not aware of what the symptoms of, of brain aneurysms are because it's just not really out there and that's what um, that's what the month of September you know and brain aneurysm awareness month is about is you know getting the word out there there's things out there that can take care of, of brain aneurysms. Stephanie says she will continue to share her story with the hopes of helping others and of course she'll continue playing music. But I'm Stephanie Rose, and uh, I really do enjoy playing progressive music with these girls. You know, God's not finished with me yet. There's, there's lots of things left for me to do.